Reef ecosystems of the Western Atlantic are becoming increasingly littered. However, the type of litter I am referring to is not the typical human-made trash that might come to mind. The litter I am referring to is a persistent invasive animal known as the lionfish. In their non-native range, lionfish eat practically everything. They reproduce abundantly, and they have no observed predators to keep their population in check. For the Western Atlantic, this is a recipe for disaster. Conservationists to Siri, offshore dive charters, and West Marine are combating excessive lionfish populations through coordinating lionfish roundups. Good morning everybody, I'm Joe Kistel. This morning, we're gonna go offshore, we're gonna clean up some reefs. Only this time, we're gonna clean the reefs of lionfish. All right, so we're getting ready to head offshore. What are we going to catch, guys? Right, because we're going to get some lionfish. Uh, Kill them lionfish. That's right, we got way too many of them offshore here, so that's how we're going to clean reefs today. We're going to get rid of some lionfish. All right, so we're heading offshore with Captain Dan. He's going to take us out to the Casablanca, right, Dan? Right. Yeah, we got about a 30 mile ride, and it looks like the sea's going to be like one or two. Captain Dan's been out here forever, so he knows where to take us, where to put us. He see lionfish, we'll see some today. While in route offshore, divers prepare and discuss the objectives of their dives ahead. The goals are simple to harvest as many lionfish as possible. Once on site, the divers make last minute preparations and enter the ocean in search of the invasive predators. Down below, divers search, but it does not take long before they encounter the creatures they are after. Lionfish populations here are prolific. Divers carefully capture the lionfish and place them in a thick bag to avoid possible puncture wounds from the animal's venomous spines. Back on the surface and dockside, the divers remove the spines and compare their catches. Who got the biggest one, guys? I did. Look at that big old belly full of probably baby red snapper. That's what we don't want. But good job today, guys. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah. The lionfish harvested during these efforts will not be discarded, but will actually be the main course for a fish cookout. Turns out, lionfish meat happens to be quite tasty. In order to have a chance to keep non-native lionfish populations in check, such harvest efforts must be executed frequently and by many. You can count on Tissiri, offshore dive charters, and West Marine to continue harvesting lionfish and provide support to control their populations.